Hello, welcome to a network concepts video on network terminology. Specifically we're looking at vertices, edges and loops. A vertex, and vertices is the way we say the plural of vertex, is a point or a dot in a network diagram where the pathways meet or intersect. In this diagram down here we've got three vertices labeled A, B and C and they are where the pathways meet. Vertices are also known as nodes, particularly in computing. An edge is any line connecting the vertices. Edges can cross each other without intersecting at a vertex. For example, in the diagram below here, we see that two uh, lines, two edges, uh, cross each other in the middle here, and there isn't a vertex. Uh, particularly indicated by a dot and a label that uh, those two edges um, meet at. They can cross each other without necessarily creating or needing a vertex. A directed edge is a type of edge that's also known as an arc and it has an arrow on it indicating that travel is only possible in the direction of the arrow. So down here on this diagram, the edge AB has an arrow on it and the edge BD has an arrow on it. So they're called directed edges and you can see the direction of travel indicated by those arrows. An undirected edge has no arrow on it, sounds logical, and travel is possible in both directions if there's no arrows. So you can see that in edges AD, AC, BC and CD there. There aren't any arrows so we can travel in any direction there. A weighted edge has a number on it that's suggesting some sort of value such as distance or time or some other value. So here I have a weighted edge in red there. It's got 286 next to it. doesn't have any units and then they often don't, these weighted edge diagrams. And But uh, trust me, from Sydney to Canberra is 286 kilometres according to Google Maps. I looked it up myself. So um, weighted edges have uh, numbers indicating things. A loop uh, starts and ends at the same vertex, so we can see a red loop there starting and ending at that vertex indicated in the diagram. It counts as one edge if we're counting up the edges in any network diagram. So there's the first few uh, pieces of terminology there for networks. Thanks for listening. I'll see you next time.